Hey guys, uh, I'm back with another video for Cody free movie add-ons. Previously I have introduced you to alternatives to uh, Exodus uh, because Exodus add-on is no longer supported by TV add-ons.ag after the Fusion repo shut down. Now uh, I told you about the add-ons called Cognant as well as Elysium. So these two are almost exactly the same code as X does, but they are currently being updated and maintained uh, by the uh, by the teams. So, um, of course, you know me. I, I want to have more um, backups. So, so we all know in the in the in this industry, in this uh, code add-on industry, uh, they can get shut down at any time. So I'm going to tell you about a few more. Uh, add-ons that uses about the same code so it works the same way pretty much um, you know X Exodus is the one the predecessor of X Exodus is called Genesis I was using Genesis a lot and really like that app uh, that uh, add-on uh, the later Genesis was no longer maintained uh, replaced by Exodus but now some some people put on a Genesis Reborn it basically relaunched Genesis. Okay, so I'll tell you how to uh, install that one. So if you go to Add-ons, uh, Video Add-ons, and then you go to the left corner, the the package sign, package icon, click that. Um, install from repository. So before you do this, you need to install the super repo. Uh, if you don't know how to do that, uh, take a look at my previous video about using. Super installing super repo as an alternative to the TV add-ons.ag, the Fusion repo. So in that video, I told you about how to uh, uh, install uh, the source for super repo as well as adding these repositories from super repo. First, after you install the source, uh, install super repo repositories, then go in there, install third-party part, third party repositories and uh, category video. Okay, so here we're going to need the third-party repositories because here you can find the repo we need for installing Genesis Reborn. Uh, of course, if you want to don't want to do this, you can <coughs> enter the source for uh, Genesis Reborn's repo directly, which is http uh, colon slash slash jesusboxrepo.xyz slash repo. Okay, so if if you don't want to do it manually, uh, you can do it that way. Uh, but if we <coughs> in the in the super repo, third-party repos, we can go to the Jesus box directly. It starts with J. There we go. <coughs> Jesus box repository. So if you click that, install. So this is the version in the. Third-party repositories. So it's going to go to super repo and install that Jesus box repo. So now that it's installed, as you see on the screen prompt, and we just go back to uh, install from repository. But this time, the Jesus repo, Jesus box repo, should appear in our list in the repos. There we go. Jesus box repository. It's installed. So we go in there, go to video add-ons. Now here are a few good things. Um, so Genesis Reborn, of course, is what we came for. So we can install that. And this version in the Jesus box is way later than the was in the super repo. Okay, so that's what you want. Okay, and now uh, while you're at, while you're here, you might as well install Flixnet. As well as Showbox Arise. Okay, so these two are uh, a very good uh, free movie and TV add-ons as well. And I'll show you later, they work very similar to Genesis Report as well. 
uh, here there's a Jesus Vox IPTV, but it needs username and password. So I guess you cannot use that. Otherwise, these three, I'm going to install them. Okay, now we can go back to our add ons, uh, video add ons, and let's see. Now, Genesis Reborn is now installed. If you want to try it out, again, the menu looks pretty similar to Exodus and other similar add ons. If you go to, for example, movies, maybe let's say, for example, theaters. going to show you the current in theater movies right so if we click any title it's going to search all the sources similar to what's in Exodus and Elysium so once all the sources providers are searched it's going to list uh, the playable uh, streams as you can see, it's pretty much the same interface, very similar. So if you don't want to wait, you can actually skip some of the sources. And if you click play, see, it's working. Okay, so you want to try out the other two I just showed you, FlixNet, see, almost exact same menu, TV shows, We do this provider search almost exactly the same. I think they all copy each other's codes, so pretty much the same thing. The important thing is, even if even though they are very similar, you have backups. Right? In case one goes down, you can use the other one. So now that we have these three installed, we have six alternatives. So so you can rest assured that none of them are mm, you always have something to play your movies and showbox arrives last but not least similar this is, is simpler actually so it has the similar movies TVs my movies my TVs but otherwise uh, it's that's pretty much it okay uh, and uh, you can you see you can see this is a very simplified menu for showbox arise because I think it's trying to imitate the showbox Android app uh, it is kind of like a simple uh, app just using uh, very uh, specialized sources it's not like it's searching for all the sources uh, but th in this case in the Kodi version of the showbox it is searching all the sources but if you try the Android app for Showbox, it's using some kind of a specific server. I think this is this way, the Kodi way is better, of course. It's search, searching for 50 plus different kind of uh, sources. So that actually, actually gives you more choices. Anyway, so now that you know how to install the Jesus Box repo and install all these three, we have three more alternatives similar to Covenant, Exodus, and Elysium. Okay, thanks for watching.